Today I'll be showing you three poses that are perfect for golfers. They focus on spinal rotations and opening through your chest. You might improve your swing because with this increased flexibility, it might improve a little bit to your swing. For the first stretch, you could use a strap if you're quite tight in your chest and shoulders, or you could use your club. Bring the hands behind the back. Draw the hands down, bring the shoulder blades a little bit closer together. Lift the chest, look up slightly. So just a gentle stretch through the chest and shoulders. Hips could push slightly forward, hands could draw back a little bit more. Breathing into the chest and shoulder area. Release the arms. We'll try triangle pose. So one foot stays at the top of your mat. The other leg lengthens behind you. Have your back foot on a diagonal so your toes would point towards the corner front end of the mat. Bring the hands to the hips, bend the knees a little bit, and then swing the hips back. Straighten the legs up, reach your front arm forward, and reach as far forward as you can. When you can't come down anymore, gently drop the hand somewhere on the leg. Try not to put too much pressure here. Lean back like there was a wall behind you, and then stretch the arm up to the sky. Keep the shoulders away from the ears. You could, if it was safe for your neck, take your gaze to the sky. But if that hurt your neck, I would look to the side or down to the floor. When you're ready, you can inhale to lift yourself up. Drop the arms. Turn your feet in so you're facing the long end of your mat. Turn your big toes in a little bit more so you're slightly pigeon-toed. Heels go a little bit wider. Hands to the hips. Inhale for height. And then exhale, fold forward from your hip creases. Bring your fingertips to the floor or use a little bit of height to block if you can't quite reach. One hand stays underneath the face. The other arm comes to the shoulder. Open the shoulder. And then keep reaching that arm to the sky. Exhale to come down. And then the other side, inhaling up and over. Exhaling to release. You can move from side to side here or you could pause and stay on one side. Take a few more breaths. When that's done, you can bend the knees Push the feet into the floor to lift yourself up and walk the feet back in towards each other. These are great poses for spinal rotation and to help open through your chest and shoulders. The last two postures are pretty strong, so I would recommend doing them after your body's a little bit warm. So some sort of a warm up, warm up, dynamic stretches, brisk walking, or even at the end of your game. Make sure everything feels safe and comfortable as always. Bring your hands to prayer position. Let your head drop down. Thank your body for all its hard work. And thank you for joining me today. Namaste. Thanks a lot, Melissa. Much more still. Including Gordon.